Welcome to Fabulous Lake Tahoe, your local's guide to the very best of America's year-round playground. I'm Jack Durst, and I'm here at State Line for your November 2014 concert report. Wow, 2014 has been going by so fast, and it's hard for me to believe that the leaves are changing color, most of the leaves are gone, and it's almost winter. I'm really psyched for a big snow winter. We've had three continuous years of drought, and nobody can guarantee what the weather's gonna do in a drought year, but I have a pretty good feeling about this being a really good ski year. And apparently some of the long range weather forecasters tend to agree because this is the one where I announce when the ski dates are. And a lot of the ski resorts are listing earlier dates this year than they did last year. So we got a lot of great concerts and events coming up this month. Starting today, the Connor Party will be playing November 4th at Cabo Wabo. There will be an open mic night with Lucas Arizu at the Fat Cat Cafe in Truckee. November 5th through 9th, Anthony Griffith and Francis DiLorenzino will be playing at the Improv at Harvey's Comedy Show. November 5th, Dire Maker will be playing at Cabo Wabo. November 6th, Bass Nectar with Kill Paris and Son of a Kick are going to be playing at the Mont Blue Showroom. Last I looked, there were still a couple of tickets available. You might be able to stub hub some tickets for it. Bass Nectar is going to be probably the biggest EDM show of this month. Base Heavy up on the North Shore is closed for the season, as is Mindful Massive. So Base Nectar at Mont Blue is probably the biggest EDM show of the month. Also, there's going to be an after party at the Blue Nightclub at the Mont Blue featuring Boombox. The JKC band will be playing at Cabo Wabo November 6th. Olympian Jamie Anderson, who you might have seen in my Olympics parade video, is going to be making a personal appearance at Azul. There will be a Tahoe tourism workshop going on just up the street at Lake Tahoe Resort Hotel across the street from Harris. Lost Whiskey Engine will be playing at the Cottonwood Bar and Grill, and The Novelist will be playing at Moody's Bistro November 6th. November 7th and 8th is our first big Psych Up for the Snow event of the year. Warren Miller's No Turning Back is going to be playing two nights at the Harris South Shore Room with Warren Miller himself making a personal appearance. Also November 7th and 8th, A-Train will be playing at Cabo Wabo. Steve and Tom will be playing at Gar Woods. November 7th, there's an evening of food and wine tasting benefit at Harris. DJ Audio One will be playing at Peak Tahoe. Volcom Stone's Mr. Plant movie will be showing at Squaw Valley. Chateau Develle will be having a wine tasting at 968 Park Hotel. Tuck Wilson will be playing at the Cottonwood Bar and Grill. The Sam Raveno Group will be playing at Moody's Bistro. DJs Chango and Gerbtron will be playing at the Coffee Bar in Truckee. And The Wonder Show with Christopher Wonder and the Go-Go Army will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club with an after party in the Red Room with Little Miss Mixer and DJ Low G. November 8th, Lisa Marie Johnson will be playing at 968 Park Hotel. Ian McFerrin and Alyssa Milner will be playing at the Cottonwood Bar and Grill. And Darcita's Open Market will be playing at Moody's Bistro. Also November 8th, there will be a chocolate and wine festival to benefit the Tahoe Safe Alliance at the North Tahoe Ritz-Carlton. Drew Holcomb and the Neighbors, Penn Ian Sparrow, with an after party with Muppet Punk and Gerbtron will be playing the 8th at the Crystal Bay Club. And Ann Ruse and Sean Cummings will be playing a Celtic Harp Music Festival at the Brewery Arts Center in Carson City. November 9th, DJ Chris English will be playing at Cabo Wabo. It will be the Barton Holiday Fair at St. Teresa's. And Streets of Truckee with Richard Blair will be playing at the Bar of America. Or November 10th, the Cash Only Band will be playing at Cabo Wabo, and there will be a paint and sip fundraiser at the Hard Rock Cafe. November 11th and 12th, Kevin O'Brien will be playing at the Cabo Wabo. November 11th, there'll be an open mic night with Lucas Arizu at Fat Cat Cafe. November 12th through 16th, Ahmed Ahmed and Farrell Ozell will be playing at the Improv at Harvey's Comedy Show. November 12th is the Tahoe Regional Young Professionals Mixer. This month's is at Azul. Also November 12th, one of the big concerts I'm personally very excited for, Michael Franti is coming to the Crystal Bay Club with special guest Ethan Tucker. I saw Michael Franti at Wanderlust 2011 and he was awesome. He was by far the best musical act I saw in a day chock full of really good musical acts. He's gonna be playing at the Crystal Bay Club November 12th with an after party with Cherry Royale in the Red Room for free. November 13th through 15th, Audio Box will be playing at Cabo Wabo. November 13th is the 7th Annual Blue Ribbon Awards Dinner, which honors environmental leaders in Lake Tahoe's business community. It's going to be going on in Harris. Dave Nettle will be making a personal appearance at the Alpen Globe Winter Film Series in Squaw Valley on November 13th. Sierra Tahoe is hosting their annual Sierra Snowball Fight Dodge Ball Tournament November 13th. There will be a Passport to Dining event at North Tahoe Event Center. And Anne-Marie Sheridan will be playing at the Cottonwood Bar and Grill November 13th. November 14th and 15th, Steve and Tom will be playing at Gar Woods. 
November 14th, this is your other big chance to have a cool EDM show in Lake Tahoe this month. Marty Party of Panty Raid is going to be playing at Whiskey Dicks, featuring side artists One More Night, Bass Mentality, and Osiris. Osiris actually appeared on this show about a year ago. Check out the clip. So, tell the people. How you doing? I'm Isai from Ghost Coast Music. Out here with Dre to Dre, born and raised in South Lake Tahoe. I'm from LA and we out here with Osiris. Catch us on the 25th. We will be here. Excellent, thank you. All right. November 14th, DJ Louis Giovanni will be playing at Peak Tahoe. Also November 14th, Two Good Winery will be having a wine tasting at 968 Park Hotel. And Moon Gravy will be playing at the Cottonwood Bar and Grill. Zeb Early will be bringing his smoked out show, soul show to the coffee bar in Truckee on November 14th. And the Polyrhythmics with an after party with World's Finest will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club. By the way, if you haven't heard of World's Finest, they are a very, very cool reggae band. You can click the annotation on your screen right now to see World's Finest performing The Kingdom, which is a great reggae song, at the Heavenly Village Concert Series this summer. November 15th, DJ Rockwell will be playing at Peak Tahoe. November 15th and 16th, the Tahoe Arts Project will be having their annual holiday fair at South Tahoe Middle School. November 15th, the Spinners, who you rem might remember from the 60s Motown scene, will be playing at the Harris South Shore Room. Rolling Stone will be playing at 968 Park Hotel. And Metal Shop, with an after party with DJ Lucky and Blue Whiting, will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club November 15th. November 16th, the Something's Blue Writing Expo is coming back to Harris. Click the annotation on your screen to see my video of last spring's Something Blue Wed Wedding Expo. Also November 16th, DJ Chris English will be playing at Cabo Wabo. November 17th, Cash Only Band will be playing at Cabo Wabo. November 18th, Reggie Hall will be playing at Cabo Wabo, and there will be an open night night with Lucas Arizu at Fat Cat Cafe. November 19th through 23rd, Mark Pita and Anna Lederman will be playing at Improv at Harvey's Comedy Show. November 19th, Jesse Kalen will be playing an acoustic set at Cabo Wabo. And Elaine Boozler, who you might remember from the 90s as one of the top comics of the whole decade of the 90s, is gonna be playing at the Crystal Bay Club. November 20th, one of my favorite local bands, Mojo Green, will be playing at the Mont Blue Blue Nightclub. Dire Maker will be playing at Cabo Wabo. And Danny Strutvant will be playing at the Cottonwood Bar and Grill. November 21st through 22nd, Bourbon Fix will be playing at Cabo Wabo. November 21st through 22nd, the Heavenly Ski and Snowboard Swap will be going on at the um, Harris parking lot. Also, November 21st is opening day at Heavenly, so there will be an Unbuckle Apri Ski Party at the Tamarack Lodge, the 21st and 22nd, if Heavenly's open. And there will also be an event at Heavenly Village with live music on the 21st and 22nd. November 21st, DJ Teddy P will be playing at Peak Tahoe. November 21st through 23rd is the Valhalla Holiday Fair. They're gonna be having a children's chorus and Santa. November 21st, Cheap Trick will be playing at the Mont Blue. November 21st is official opening day at Heavenly. I think November 21st is kind of pushing it for early opening this year, given how little snow we have on the ground so far, but we'll see. If, if there's snow, Heavenly will be open. Also November 21st, Tahoe Regional Young Professionals are having their winter white party at the Riva Grill. Turn Up in Tahoe will be coming to the Fat Cat Cafe in Truckee featuring Mick Taylor, Easy Baby, Just Me, Anomaly, Retro, J Sav, Tay Breeze, and Outrage Fiasco. Also November 21st, An Elegant Affair will be coming to the Boatworks Mall to benefit the Tahoe Safe Alliance. And Foreverland will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club Crown Room with an after party with Mr. Rooney and IJV in the Red Room. November 22nd, country superstar Travis Tripp will be playing at Harris South Shore Room. The Blokes will be playing at 968 Park Hotel. Melvin Seals with, with the Jerry Garcia Band, New Moon and an after party with the Electric Jimmies will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club that night. DJ Chris English will be playing November 23rd at Cabo Wabo. November 24th, Cash Only Band will be playing at Cabo Wabo. November 25th, Reggie Hall will be playing at Cabo Wabo. And there will be an open mic night with Lucas Arizu at Fat Cat Cafe. November 26th, weather permitting, is going to be opening day at Squaw Valley. There's going to be all kinds of events in the Squaw Valley courtyards and in the village. Um, also November 26th, Jesse Kalen will be playing an acoustic set at Cabo Wabo. And Chuck Dunn will be playing at Bar of America. November 27th, Thanksgiving dinner at High Camp at Squaw Valley. Or Wrestler's Moon will be playing at Bar of America. November 28th to 29th, Warren Miller's No Turning Back will be playing again at Squaw Valley. There will be an Unbreckle Lapry ski party with the Heavenly Angels and a DJ, possibly a DJ on their Caterpillar out on the snow, going on at Heavenly that night. Nothing Personal will be playing at Cabo Wabo November 28th and 29th. Steve and Tom will be playing at Gar Woods. And Dip and Sauce will be playing at Bar of America. And November 28th, 
DJ Miles Medina with DJ JB will be playing at Peak Tahoe. Madrono Vineyards will be having a wine tasting at 968 Park Hotel, and Lonesome Locomotive will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club. If you're interested in seeing more of Lonesome Locomotive, click the annotation on your screen to see the video I made of them at the Heavenly Village Concert Series this year. November 29th through December 13th, Heavenly is going to be hosting the Heavenly Winter Ignite Series. Go to heavenly.com for more information about that. November 29th, Brett Michaels will be playing at the Mont Blue. 70s band Tower of Power will be playing at Harris South Showroom, and it will be the annual Locals Last Waltz with Jelly Fred, the Redfield Clipper Band, and a long list of guest artists to be announced at the Crystal Bay Club that night. November 30th, DJ Chris English will be playing at Cabo Wabo, and December 1st, Cash Only Band will be playing at Cabo Wabo. Also, every Saturday night at Peak Tahoe, DJ SN1 and DJ Rick Gee do a double team DJ show. And every Friday night, DJ Joss Beats does a DJ show at Peak Tahoe. So stay tuned to Fabulous Lake Tahoe. There's going to be a video of the holiday fair coming up. If you haven't seen my video of the Freakers Ball yet, check out my video of the Freakers Ball. There were some really awesome costumes this year. Check out the werewolf. It's awesome. Also, um, stay tuned to Fabulous Lake Tahoe. And thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Thank you. And keep Tahoe blue. Bye.